Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm going to do this look for you today. And it's using this LA Colors eyeshadow trio. And this is in Iris. This look is for the Tisha 76. And I will be using all three colors today. The first time I used that trio, I did a face of the day. But I didn't use all three eyeshadows. All I used was the middle color. Today I'll be using all three. So this is for you, Tisha. So I already applied my eyelid primer, which is the ELF $1 eyelid primer. I did my brows with this NYC eyeliner pencil. And I finished them off with this Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Kit in Ash Brown. And I used the lightest color in the middle, just that one. Okay, so now to begin, I'm going to start this look off using this L'Oreal Hip Eyeshadow Duo. And this is in Shady. This is what Shady looks like. And I will be using this light color right there. I'll be picking up that shadow with this little crease brush. I also got a pencil brush. And I will be applying that into my outer V and crease. So I'm going to apply this e.l.f. Cream Eyeshadow Duo in Berry Mix. I'm going to be applying that light frosty color with a concealer brush onto my lid. Now I will be applying the first color, which is this one in the middle, on my lid. And this is from the LA Colors Eyeshadow Palette in Iris. Applying it on the one third of my eye. The eyeshadow trio again. And I will be applying this eyeshadow right beside the first eyeshadow. And with this little applicator that I got from an LA Colors Loose Eyeshadow Pigment, um, I departed a long time ago. I'm going to be grabbing that eyeshadow right there. And I'm going right into my outer V. Single eyeshadow in winter white. And I'm going to apply that to my brow bone. To warm up that outer V, we're picking up a crease brush. And the eyeshadow duo by L'Oreal Hip and Shady, we're picking up that dark brown. And we're applying that right into the crease and up. Now I'm going to be applying this Revlon Colorstay Mineral Finishing Powder in 020 Suntan Matte. And this is what it looks like. It's beautiful. This Boutique Powder Brush. Just going to apply that all over. And it gives me a dewy look. I like it. Now I'm gonna take this slanted blush brush and with this wet n wild bronzer in goddess. I'm going to carve myself up some cheekbones. I'm going to be picking up this e.l.f. Healthy Glow Bronzing Powder, but it's much too light for my skin tone, so I use it as a highlight powder. And that's what it looks like. And with the powder brush from Boutique, I take it lightly and apply that on my cheekbones. See that golden glow? Beautiful. That's what I was after. The Santee All Over Blusher. And I guess I'll be going in that color right there. 
And I'll be doing that with the big face brush. For mascara, I'll be using this Alme One Coat Dial Up in black. Now I'm going to be picking up this Jordana Color Extend Lip Liner in Lingerberry. I'm not lining my lips. I'll be picking up this Nicka K lipstick in 921 pink tint. Purchased this like a month or two ago. So this will be my first time trying it. So this is the look. I hope you all enjoyed. And thank you, the Tisha76. Now I'm going to be giving you some swatches. Swatches of the Eyeshadow Trio and Iris by LA Colors. And those are the colors I have on my lids. And here they go right there. This color is on the inner one third of my eyelid. This one is near my outer V. And that one went on the outer part of my outer V and a little on the crease. Now with the L'Oreal Hip Eyeshadow Duo in Shady. It goes right there. Probably won't be able to see it too good, but there it goes. I like using this as a transition color. And the dark brown in the Duo. It's in my outer V and crease also. And there it goes right there. lipstick is by Nika K and it's a 921 pink tint. And that's the swatch for it right there. And the Jordana Color Extend Lip Liner in Lingerberry. Can you swatch that right now? Right underneath the lipstick. That's the Lip Liner in Lingerberry by Jordana Color Extend. I got these in a boutique in Manhattan a few years ago. I've had them for quite a while. Second time I wear them. So this is what they look like. Light lavender on top and a deeper purple at the bottom. Very pretty. Goes great with the dress I am wearing. So that's it. That's my look. I hope you all enjoyed, and until next time, you'll stay blessed and beautiful, and ciao.